Yep. All right, so we've got Thor versus Matt R. Matt R going pink Falcon. Always. I mean, Breast that's money, man. So Thor on this, I mean, I really don't like taking Falcon to Battlefield, period. Um, I don't know what the starter stages are for um, um, PM, but I, Matt R especially on this stage, he can just do so much crazy stuff. And I mean, he'll get around Link's um, projectiles fairly easily too. The issue is, it's I, I guess uh, Thor Thor didn't want the something tiny because he needs to be able to get away. Right. And he didn't, so that's Yoshi's. And I don't know which he banned, but it was either Smashville or uh, Poke Stadium. And so he just wanted something with a little, not not as flat, not as big. Um, yeah. I guess I guess I don't know. I would think yeah. that he was just would just try to play, play keep away basically the whole time. I mean, um, hey, it's working right now. Yeah. Even though the stage is a very good stage for Falcon, Thor is making it look fairly good for Link too. I don't think it's a bad Link stage. Yeah, I mean, look at that. Yeah. He read the um, get up attack, normal get up, and uh, dared, and it was the very bomb. good dare. Bomb mm, helping the recovery a little bit, but see, that's a, it's a situation where it might just be um, Matt R is not as used to fighting against a Link. But as soon as you see him pull that bomb and take the hit, you know he has to do an up B. You lose your jump? Um, or you just assume that he's jumped out? Well, no, no, no. You usually have lost your jump by the time you pull right. the bomb and everything. So you know he's going for that ledge, unless he's super close. But if he was super close, he would just tether. Mm -hmm. So You think he just should have grabbed ledge? He should have just grabbed ledge. He would have easily gotten the kill. Oh. But... <laughs> Got two quick kills while I was explaining all of that. The Falcon thing. There's a reason Matt R has remained at the top of multiple <laughs> power rankings for a very long time. Thor, good up air. Tries to go for the hard read, but doesn't get punished for it. Spin to win. Everybody's favorite. Another spin to win. Great DI, though. So the dash attack doesn't connect, but the down smash does. No follow up, but he keeps Thor's, him on the ledge. Thor's doing a really good job of keeping um, ledge pressure without actually having to go Com out commit, there. Yeah. yeah, he doesn't have to commit. He's throwing bombs, he's shooting arrows. It's Thor's thing. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it's Link's thing, but <laughs> yeah. Thor definitely Thor is makes Link. it his own. Oh. Good recovery. Good sweet spot. He's right able, now, he's able to get back on. Right now, Matt R is really fishing for those knees. For sure. That'll be it. Oh, wait, no. It goes for the back and yeah. up air into knee. He's like, I need a few more percentage points before I get this knee. And then yes. he gets it. We're all robots here. <laughs> Ooh, that was strange. I wonder if that's reliable. Uh, like um, the fading back boomerang to like plop down onto the ledge. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It might be PM specific. Yeah. It might be uh, Thor specific. Yeah. Gets the up smash though. Nice Follows arrow. it up with the snipe. Oh. Probably didn't mean to jump. Yeah, he definitely did not mean to do that. Safer though, because it seemed like Matt was standing shield. Thor is definitely able, still able to bring this back. He just needs to get a good hit and then follow up with an edge guard or sit and spin. Yeah, I mean, unfortunately for him, Falcon's so heavy that he won't die from a spin to win for a little bit still. Even I think I don't know that that's Matt true. Matt R's DI's been pretty on point okay. for that. Okay. The DI's a little bit weird against yeah. his up B, but. Matt Ars hasn't gotten poor DI once from it. Mm. So it has oh. to be, Oh, wow, though. That's... That was um, a really clutch force. The match. wait. He waited. He timed it perfectly. Up smash. Right, dash bit, attack. Ooh. Back air. Man, he's making Link look like he's all about the combo game. Matt dropped it. <laughs> Uncharacteristic. <laughs> Regardless of the situation. Oh. Full hop down air. Yeah, Matt Matt is definitely having That's some it. uncharacteristic flubs, and Thor clutches that out very impressively. Proud of you, Thor. <laughs> yeah. So on that very last um, up B, you saw how Matt R didn't di it poorly, um, and he ended up getting soft spiked. For sure. I don't know any di that would have saved him. <laughs> Back to Battlefield. I'm not surprised. Yeah, I mean, it's still a good stage. Yep. Matt R still knows it fairly well. He just needs <laughs> to stop. He just needs to not, um, you know, full hop down air and then get punished hard. I mean, he had a pretty commanding lead of that last match, yep. but you give Thor an inch and he will take that stop. Thor is a 
very clutch player. Just ask me at the last tournament. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the one that lasted for like 15 minutes? Uh, probably. It so was... Matt R goes super deep. Thor didn't expect it. And he gets a... Yeah, like you just said, beautiful back air. <laughs> um, only taking 6%. Already looking to take the second stock. Hard not to get demoralized, but... Oh, so he doesn't sweet approach. spot it, but... Uh, Matt R respecting it. Maybe there a little bit go. too much, but he gets the fadeaway knee. This will probably be... Nope. Yeah, see... I'm surprised Matt is just not grabbing ledge more. Maybe he doesn't know the exact active frames on Link's up B. I'm like, sure he doesn't. Whatever. But there was a couple times where he definitely could have easily just Ooh. wave shine back or some, or sorry, wave dash back and uh, grab ledge. But hey, he's got two stocks. I sense an up B. Um, that's gonna be a big punish. Yeah, yeah. he makes him count. Man, there we the go. One though. good thing he crouch canceled. Link's down tilt's great for setting up into a down air like that. Absolutely, it pops them up a lot like uh, Falcon's down tilt. Mm -hmm. uh, Lots of people. Thor down. only one stock behind, but one good up air like that, and this will be a back air or even a stomp. See, he makes he, it back. He's, he he's making it back every time. Wave dashed instead of jumped, and that would have made him hold onto the ledge for just a little bit longer. I know a lot of people shy away from that because, you know, the jump, you can't suicide that way. Mm -hmm. Wave dash, you can accidentally, you know, full hop and then air dodge That's off. Up. But, um... There we go. That'll do it, yeah. yeah. At 186, you're not surviving. I think the last up throw that where he went for the knee also could have killed with him up air. Um, a little bit of a mistake, but... Right. He was able oh, to, he was that able was to close a great full hop into oh, yeah. fast fall dare. Leading to 63. Oh my gosh. 84 percent damage. Can he make all it down? from that one string. <gasps> Odoron whispering. Oh I'm so excited. Trying to intimidate. Odoron's my boy. Is it is it intimidation when you whisper sweet nothings to your opponent? <laughs> uh, I bet Thor was wishing that he had some sweet nothings from Matt R right now though. Gets the read on the roll. Gets another read. Uh, I don't know if three up smashes yeah. is necessarily sorry, but he gets the double jab into grab, goes for the fair, oh. too high of a percent for that to work. It's really anyone. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> um, not oh. necessarily anyone's game though. That was well timed. Uh, the bomb exploded right as the up B ended, protecting yes. him from any kind of punish. Link there mains get used to just holding onto the bomb and realizing like, yeah, I. Oh, oh no. Yeah, the suicide. So as I was saying, Link mains are used to holding onto that bomb and using it to save them from grabs, to save it from combos. Um, they're not afraid to take the 7% damage or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. So Matt are really commanding second game, um, but Thor knows these his counter picks fairly well. I'm predicting the um, Pikmin stage, yeah, Distant Planet or Norfair. He really likes those two stages. Absolutely. Alright, so we got some uh, pretty serious consideration for stages here. Uh, Still considering? If it takes them all this time just to go to Norfair or Distant Planet. Nick has wandered away anyway. Hey, I'll, I'll compensate you. Don't start yet. Okay. I mean, you guys are being recorded right now. We're ready. It's Norfair. Got it. So, yeah, DP and Norfair are still open. It's. Oh. Alright. You know, your guys are good. You're totally good. Alright, so what did I say? Distant Planet. You called it. It's almost like I know these things. <laughs> so, Link's F tilt, I don't see it very often used in this game. But, it's laggy, Thor, but... Thor just did it fairly well. It's not also that strong, I don't think, right? No, um, I think I think it scales okay. I think it will kill eventually. Right. Um, 
But against someone like Falcon, you might as well just F smash if you can land the yeah, F tilt. Absolutely. Right, because first hit of F smash is the That's the most damage. Yeah. Is it First hit does which the ones, most... Which one sends you up, which one sends you forward? Because um, I think they're First hit sends you up, and it's supposed to like send you up so that the second one can hit. Uh-huh. Um and the first one does more damage than the second one, but the second one does more dock back. Right. So Thor uh, really looking for that up smash. Um, rolls on and he gets no. punished pretty heavily for this. But he uses the bomb to cover himself and he makes it back even though he's at 150% up, oh, 170. That'll That's do it. it. That's it. Yeah. With the dash dances though. So, one thing, Ooh. One thing <laughs> that uh, Thor is really good at is putting those bombs into a place that the other person doesn't expect. And then they'll do something like that where they'll do a double jump back air for no reason because they're like tech practicing <laughs> or whatever. And then they land on it, and then they're dead. And you're like, how did that bomb even hit me? And how did it kill me? <laughs> yes. So Thor is definitely keeping this close. Doing a really good job um, of trying to get out of these combos. It's not necessarily working, but I mean, that's that's the name of the game when you're playing Link. You're going to get comboed a lot. The perfect weight, the perfect fall speed. Yep. Always has been, always will be. His fastest move is Bam. his neutral air, and it, it's a really good move, but... Um, yeah, the neutral air does not work like Luigi's or Yoshi's, where it just beats out everything. Right. It's um, good. It's still it's still really good. It's one of his best. Ooh. Oh no. Yeah, that. That's Maybe not could detect it, but you can tech a lot of things. But I mean, theoretically, you right. can tech a lot of things, but I don't know if you actually that's, can. Yeah, that's so, um, Thor's really fishing for these up smashes, and I don't think they're gonna connect that much on this map. That's it. Um, he make, he he's he's made it back this this matchup. I think I think Thor's doing as well as he's doing. Not that this game is uh, the best that he's played. Right. It's because he, he makes it back to stage unchallenged every time. Right. And it's because of his projectiles. Absolutely. And like I said last game, uh, Matt R would prefer to respect the space than get some of these go. easy That's... ledge hogs. That should be stock. That's yeah. it. That's good set, boys. So Thor had a really clutch first game, and then Matt R just took it back, showing why he's the resident uh, number one.